Welcome back to another episode of Drink Tales and Merry Christmas. Today is Christmas Day. Mm -hmm. And if you haven't started drinking yet, I know we've been putting up a lot of Christmas themed cocktails, but we got one more for you. This is a cocktail you can use for Christmas morning, Christmas dinner, or just Christmas hanging around, chilling, waiting on dinner to be made. Christmas Eve, possibly. Yeah, Christmas Eve, you can drink this. Well, if you're watching this already, uh, it's passed. Yeah, Christmas I mean. Eve is passed, but a while away for next year. Yeah. Or New Year's. So you what can, we got? You could do this for New Year's as well. Mm -hmm. It's just a, your run-of-the-mill punch. Run-of-the-mill punch. I mean, it's not called a run-of-the-mill punch, okay. but I mean, it's just, you're basically going to take your holiday-themed flavors mm -hmm. and mix them with the appropriate spirits that you have on hand. Right. Um... In this instance, I'm going to use... I'm going to do two versions of this. Mm -hmm. One is going to be with cranberry juice. Mm -hmm. And as you may know, cranberry is like a staple as far as flavors around this time of year. Okay. Flavors and tasting notes around this time of year. And mm -hmm. I'm going to do one with pineapple as well. Okay. And so we have our lime. Uh, for a serving of one, I'm going to put the instructions in the description, mm -hmm. but I'm actually doing this for two. Mm -hmm. And I know that's going to sound weird because I'm doing different, you know, takes on this, mm -hmm. but you'll see, you'll see where you'll be able to diverge when I get there. So we got our lime juice and next we're going to add our, our spirits. Um... I'm going to use vodka. Mm -hmm. It was going to be regular vodka. We don't have regular vodka, so mm -hmm. I'm going to use Island John. Mm -hmm. Nothing wrong with Island John. As a matter of fact, the mango and the peach flavorings of this vodka mm -hmm. should work wonders with what we're doing here. Mm -hmm. Since, you know, main, this is going to be mainly a fruity... Uh, a fruity drink, as it were. Mm -hmm. And Island John is a quality cocktail it or is. quality vodka should I say mm -hmm. it makes quality cocktails if you're using it right yes yes it does so we're gonna do that thing and we're gonna add some Saint Germain mm -hmm. gonna do an ounce of Saint Germain for this. Now I want you people to keep in mind that the, that the measurements that I'm using for this is for two servings, not one. You will get the amounts for one serving right in the description. Mm -hmm. Now you guys may have noticed I haven't put simple syrup in here because I feel that the sweetness from the juices will make up for right, right, that. Right. And we're going to add our ice and shake. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now you're gonna add your juices, which, you know what, I think I'll do an ounce and a half of each. You got your ounce and a half of cranberry. Just yet. A couple more things we need to do. 
Now, this is the part where you can do whatever you want with this. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna use club soda this time around. Mm -hmm. But what I suggest you do mm -hmm. is maybe a Prosecco or a Champagne. Okay. Maybe Brut Champagne, Rosé Champagne, Brut Rosé. It just depends on, you know, what flavor you're wanting to go for. Mm -hmm. And your garnish can also be whatever you want as well. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna use raspberries this time around. garnish may be maybe some rosemary to go with the floral notes that you get from the um, uh, Saint Germain. Mm -hmm. uh, perhaps cranberry since you know it is a holiday flavor. Mm -hmm. And there you go. Alright. I'll try the pineapple first. See what you mean by adding Prosecco or Brut? Mm -hmm. Cause it gives it that added booziness. Island John is peeking through as well. Oh, Cranberries. Cranberries good too. But definitely using club soda. Yeah, you're right about using pr pr Prosecco champagne or Brut champagne. Gives it that added punch and flavor. Mm -hmm. But very good. Um, I have I have a name for this. You definitely get more tropical notes from this. Mm -hmm. I have a name for both of these. You're gonna say jingle juice is already taken. No, but close. I was gonna call it jingle bell punch. I think that's already taken. Damn it. <laughs> well, I mean, what's in a name? It's just holiday punch. Okay. Done any way you want. Official drink tales holiday punch. Mm -hmm. This is how we do it here mm -hmm. in the drink tale. If you wanna stir this as well, do that. Yeah, I really like these. And you know, it's a semi-quick, easy recipe. Mm -hmm. If you just need to get something that's alcoholic in your system. Mm -hmm. For the holidays. Yeah. <clears throat> I mean, if you need to do that, I suggest you go seek some services to help you with that. <laughs> but if you're looking to entertain, drink. exactly. Maybe you're tired of eggnog. I know everybody does eggnog. Mm -hmm. Maybe you want different flavors. Mm -hmm. This will this will hit the spot exactly. This this goes great with like a breakfast brunch, mm -hmm. and definitely like a breakfast, like a, a Christmas dinner type situation. Mm -hmm. I know for those that celebrate the holidays that are in warmer client climates, mm -hmm. this you know this is a lifesaver as it were. Mm -hmm. Especially if you're doing the pineapple version of this. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, that, those, those both of them are really good. I like a lot. And with that said, that'll do it for this episode of Drink Tales. Be sure to like and subscribe. Hit that bell so that you're notified of all content coming to the channel. Also, check us out on Instagram, check us out on Twitter, and check us out on Facebook. And if you guys know of any food and drink, something mm -hmm. that we may enjoy, mm -hmm. you know, 2022 is like, it's right there. Mm -hmm. I see it. Mm -hmm. Like, it's, it's around the corner. It's like, away. Can, I, can I come out now? <laughs> <laughs> like, like, five more days, guys. Five mm -hmm. more days. Mm -hmm. Seven. It's a week away. I mean, whatever. 
um, you know, let us know about it. We want to enter 2022 uh, tasting all the goodness that it has. Mm -hmm. So let us know, you know, how we can get our hands on that stuff. Tell yeah. us, tell us what it is. Tell us where where to go. Mm -hmm. Perhaps you can send it to us. I, I mean, let, just hit us up in our DMs. Let's talk about it. Let's it, have it, a conversation. Exactly. Twenty twenty, like you said, twenty twenty two is around the corner. We can see it. Like we want to enter twenty twenty two strong. But that'll do it for this episode of Drink Tales. Also, guys, share share this around the globe. Share this around the internet. You know, if anyone's looking for some holiday recipes for drinks, share these, share all the other ones we've done over the past month. And until next time, everybody, Merry Christmas and peace.